that I'm just getting started. Oh yeah, I'm just getting started. Yeah. Hey. Said I gotta work the hardest. Oh yeah, I'm just getting started. What's up? What's up? Just left Walmart. Feel me? I had to get a couple things, had to get right. It's a beautiful day out, man. Can't hold you. How you doing, Christy? Doing good, I'm doing good. What's up, Jen? Hey, yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm just getting started. Said I gotta work the hardest. Gene, what up? Uh-huh. Yeah, man, today, today's episode, uh, really just, you know, want to say thanks to everybody, uh, tuning in. Um, you know, today's episode, I felt like I just had to go live and just talk about a few releases. Word. But beyond that, you know, this is also a call to all people watching. How y'all doing? Just checking in on you. Rob reporting in. I love doing videos when I'm in traffic. Love it. Where? Said I'm just getting started. Love the video? That's what I'm talking about, man. Creative, man. We do what we want over here. You know? We do what we want, man. My guy Robert and Crystal, man. Shout outs to them. Yeah, man. We made a few plays happen. We had no script. All of that is just off the beam. This was like, you know what? I got a few fits. You know? I know, I know a couple of scenery locations that scenic locations we could you know pop a few shots oh and yeah man we made it happen you know and it turned out nice and i can't wait for part two we definitely got a few scenes already for part two and they're doing some construction on this side where yeah so you know just trying to stay busy Just trying to get some shopping done. You feel me? Riding around today. Yeah, man. Thank you for everybody that tuned in on that video. Keep sharing. Tell all your friends. You feel me? It's a great time to drop heat, especially in the times of revolution and and chaos. To be honest. Hope everybody's holding up in the quarantine. You know what I mean? A lot of people not working right now. You know, so just gotta give thanks, man, for everything and everyone in your life. You know what I mean? Big facts. Yeah. If you guys, if you guys got any. If you guys got any ideas as far as like, as far as like, uh, what type of artwork y'all want to see me do, put that in the comment section. You know, I, I do what I do at natural, at random, but like, if, if y'all want to see something graphic wise to match music when we put it out, let me know. Me and me and my art director, me and my photographer, we'll, uh, you know, we like to flex the muscles. You know what I mean? We like to you know, try different things. Joey, Cosmo. Oh yeah, man, the Badman got tunes, man. We gotta make a couple hits for the summer, that's a fact. Pulling up an A plus now. Word. Yeah. How you doing? Ski 
Ski. You, you want to see the flash? Bet. Bet. That's a, that's a good one, G. I'm going to get the flash outfit. You got the flash ring. You know what I'm saying? We'll, we'll make a cover art. We'll make that happen. Make that happen. I'm going to pump gas real quick. One sec. Yeah, the flash will be fire, killing him. Sending you a new pack with the no oh, say that. Say that, yeah, man. Yeah, like, I've, I've just been trying to lock in, like, heavy. I know I've been working a lot lately, but the sooner the better, man. Definitely, and hopefully, hopefully when we get back in the stool, me and Brown, you know what I mean? We could, we could sneak peek some things, have some teases going on. Come on, come on. I'm glad y'all like the music video, man. I, and if for those that know me, y'all know I don't have that many music videos out. Man, what's up? You know, I don't have that many music videos out. You know what I mean? Me and Terry Little, we had to kick it off early with our champion game six. Life goes on. Things came out classic. And we just put another classic on y'all, you feel me? So, yeah, man, you know, one gold brick at a time, man. We ain't rushing nothing at all. Big facts. At some point, I want to make another video uh, kind of talking about, you know, everything in the world going on movement the protests um you know big ups to big ups to everybody participating in a healthy manner and um and you know whether it was looting involved or involved or not like you know uh just i'm glad i'm glad there's more people getting active and just heightening the awareness of it you know it seems like people were just sleeping on the fact that you know we've been targeted out here for so long i don't even understand that it's like how could you sleep at night but you know it is what it is you know what i mean that's what it is moving strong a lot of pride yeah man the community's definitely getting active and i like seeing that i think i had a big protest the other day or a few days ago you know what I'm saying? Like, back to back. Yeah, it was definitely different. And I feel like the whole world feels it by now. You know what I mean? So, as for the COVID, I never really put too much stock in the COVID. You know what I'm saying? I have my own beliefs and views and just things. That, how y'all doing? Hey. You know, I have my own beliefs and views on the agenda at hand and... It's a lot of nasty politicians, man. It's a lot of nasty celebrities out here. 
you know, trying to trying to have a hand in, in what's going on and trying to make it look like they was down for the cause. But, you know. And, you know, that's another thing, too. It's been tricky for a lot of artists. I feel like a lot of artists, too, had, had uh, trouble. Not, I wouldn't say speaking, but just not really calculating the things they're saying all the way like if that makes sense like i feel like a lot of people should have been more empathetic or or just you know kind of instead of just rushing to post something just because everybody's posting go on the man not just because everybody's posting you gotta post it's kind of like fall back observe see what's up check the temperature like no one did that i just saw like a lot of people jumping out the window and then next thing you know you know they have to issue another statement saying they're sorry it's like how you talking about you know what i mean how you talking about so i don't know i know we're gonna get right though as for prime fire the song i dropped not too long ago it's crazy because that song, I know I captioned it as like the coronavirus cure and, you know, Rasta La Cura and, you know, I, I really believe that by the way, that just wasn't just to say it, I really put that belief in that song and here's why, like, playing with frequency actually can help you channel your body in a way to where you can just have a, re not only a refreshed state of mind, but actually feel charged up and 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 kind of kind of heal the the sickness in in the mentality and the mindset of how to look at something or how to go about something you know and every time when i listen to that song not just because i made it but every time when i listen to it i get chills based off how hard i went in on certain sections of it and i think for those of you guys that don't really pay attention to that, that's very important to pay attention to because I'm doing a lot of reconfiguring and reprogramming and y'all don't even know it. Y'all just like, oh, fresh cover art, dope sound. Yeah, it's a, it's a hit or it's a bop, whatever. But for me, like, that's why I go so hard with this music. You know, there's a time and place to be serious, happy, playful, you know, talk your shit. But shit, if you could do all of that in one, you feel me? And have the people, you know, leave off with a vibe, you know, that they'll forever remember. Like, I feel like, you know, my energy in every track proves that and shows that. And so, yeah, man, just rock my energy. You feel me? Just rock my energy. You know, I'm, I'm producing it. I'm creating it for you guys. My guy Brown, he's helping aiding me on that. My guy Ainge, he's helped aiding me on that. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know. It's just it's just a great time to, to appreciate um, real art in any form. So and and not to hold you in that song Prime Fire because it was released a month ahead of schedule, like it was set for May. Um, and the reason why I do songs a month ahead of time is because Spotify has a habit of putting you on their like playlist or algorithm if you give them more time. So, needless to say, when I dropped it exclusively on SoundCloud, I basically predicted the pandemic in that song. If you listen to the second song, the second part of that song, I display and created the whole war scene. I don't think I, like most people really paid attention to that. I probably just thought, oh my God, like, He's shooting in the song. He's, you know, like having the Mortal Kombat finish him thing in the song. Nah, like all of that was placed in there for a reason. And I kind of feel like I'm responsible for the shit. And if I am, you know, it is what it is. The world had to wake up eventually. But um, I just wanted to let y'all know how powerful music is. You know what I mean? Because for me to be aligned and in tune with the earth on that level, you know what I mean? And then it releases the 23rd and... Then a few days later, you know, there's havoc. You know what I mean? And for me to be accurate on that with Prime Fire, like, y'all not even understanding. Like, the show that I got that title from was called um, The Hundred. And The Flame, I think, in the fifth season, 
I mean, really, they kind of talk about it in the beginning, but in the fifth season, they break it down as to like how the earth, you know, was scorched in a in a crazy flame and like life was just, you know, gone. You know what I'm saying? Vanished. You feel me? And, um, you know, later on, you know, they people in space come down to earth. They find it that it's habitable and that there's other people living on it. So, you know, they're just kind of. I don't know. It kind of made me feel like a, a prophet in a way. For real. But, um, yeah, man, Prime Fire. You know, for all those people that bumped that, you could check that on uh, Apple, Spotify, uh, SoundCloud. You could stream me, Blame Bent. You know what I mean? And, um, yeah, I just wanted to make a video for the fans. Sis! Well, I'll go on, sis. Hey. Yeah, I just wanted to make a vid for the fans. Um, just letting y'all know I appreciate y'all. And, um, yeah, man, as soon as I can get back in the studio, you know what I mean? We gonna, you know, keep chefing up and keep doing what we do. And, uh, yeah, I'm about to head to the crib right now. Cop two games, cop some food. What's up, sis? How you doing? All right. Yeah, I'm about to. I got work at like five, so I'm just just trying to go live real quick. See what I go on out here. Be safe out there, you guys. Um, and yeah. So in the next time, let me know what y'all think about the music video. Leave your comments again. If y'all have any cool cover art concepts, Pat Wagwan Pat. If y'all have any cool cover art concepts, let me know. G already put up uh, the notion for doing the flash. So now I'm gonna cop a flash outfit and we're gonna do what we do best. Make some magic, probably have a song themed around that. I might call the song Flashpoint. It's, it's that simple to me, you know what I mean? It ain't even that hard. So, yeah, I love y'all. Sounds. I love y'all. Be easy. Be safe. Get money. Take care of the family. And, um, yeah, tune in next time. Dijon, what's up, bro? Hey. Yeah, man. It's been epic today. I woke up just... I'm just riding around. I could have been at home. I'm just riding around trying to chat to you guys, man. Riding around, man. Riding around the city. Ithaca, hometown. Sound, sound. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. We here. We here. It's lovely, man. Shout out to all the artists doing their thing, putting out music in a time like this. It's very strenuous to put out content. I ain't gonna hold you. You know? It's very strenuous, especially with the jobs you know, cut cut to a minimum and just the funds coming in tight. For a while when I wasn't working, I couldn't even get unemployment because the whole site froze. Not much. Chilling, chilling, riding around, you know. You already know how that go. Felt like dropping a little bit ski, checking in on my people, see where I go on. Let me head to the south. Yeah. Where we got some heat. Nah, that one joint with you and Cannon was murder. Yeah, I mean, I cleaned up on that one. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, man. We gotta stay focused. That's all it is, man. We just gotta stay focused, live to inspire. Feel me? I was saying, too, for the new folks in the, in the chat right now, if y'all got any cover art ideas that y'all want to see me pop off, let me know. Me and my photographer, we want to flex the muscles. Feel me? We, we gotta. We, and the, the cool thing is too, like, you know, we could really pull it off for you guys. Like, you know, we match that with a song or two. You know, drop a little EP. You know what I'm saying? You know, something light. You know, just keep it moving. So hopefully we can get back in the studio with Brown. You know, Brown. Brown doing his thing. Brown laying low at the moment. He got these sick ass headphones too that got the mix game on point. You know that boy stay in the lab. 
about to fuck shit up. Big facts. Big facts. I already know. I already know. You feel me? Shit. Um, what else? What else? This, I feel like there's something else I want to add. Oh, under control. Um, for those that use SoundCloud in any way, shape, or form, stream under control. I'm like close to 10K naturally. Everything is natural. You know, comments, likes, everything is natural, and it's a beautiful thing. You know what I'm saying? It's really a beautiful thing. So, if y'all can, let's, let's try to get that to at least 10 racks, and then I'm going to just focus on other songs to promote to try to get their numbers up, too. Oh, that's, that's nice. Yeah. I'm just really riding around today. I just wanted to make a video, check in on my people. You feel me? Making sure that all my brethren, all my sisters, everybody is just in tune, doing their thing. They woke up today. It's another day to be thankful for. You feel me? Jordan, what up, bro? Wagwan, wagwan. Yeah, man. I just dropped a new music video. Thank you. Dropped a new music video. Under the sun and upstate immortals, man. Upstate immortals, man. Talk about it. Feel me? Share it with the whole city, man. We chef that one up. That one's different. That one's different. There's a lot of different sauce out here, but that one we made sure that that was gonna hit different. You know, that's the radical left. You feel me? When you move righteous, that's how you drop a radical left. You feel me? So, I, yeah, take yeah. So yeah, man. Um, I'm just I'm just happy and excited that things is coming together and, and we we putting out content and everybody here is motiv motivating everybody to put out something and just stay current, stay consistent. You know, I feel like when I came back into the game and did the whole rebrand to my original name, that like I don't know, like the the flame is just different now. You know what I'm saying? Like, and of course over time when you practice something over and over, like. You know what I mean? You you hopefully um, grow to a point where it's like everything is natural and it, and it works out for you. You know what I'm saying? So I just feel like that's what it is right now for me. You know what I mean? And I'm glad that, you know, for the people that saw me in my early stages, they still rocking with me. You know what I'm saying? And, and you know, they.